Wow! That twist! You now? Ichcha, is this correct? Are correct won't cut it. Spine ekdam erect and poise. That's what people want to see. Dancer in command of herself, her movements. Yeah, you know why? Because they're not. Exactly. That's much better. When people see a dancer, what they're most impressed by is how they command their moves. Because most people can't control anything about themselves or their lives. The love hooks up. Okay, you're giving this one more than 30 seconds. I'm sure he's special. Never kiss and tell, Miss Trisha Saini. Interesting, na? What? Nahi. I mean, after a contemporary dance session, you're going to do the oldest dance in the world. Hi. Hi. Manav. Itcha. Will you just keep looking or should we order something? Yeah, sure. I'm sorry. By the way, how's your foot? Because you posted that you sprained your leg in the Mumbai tour. It's fine now. Thank you. Impressive. You've been stalking me, huh? Hey. You can call it following. Should we order something? What would you like? Make yourself comfortable. I'll come in two minutes. Why did you stop? Play?
What happened? Get out. Excuse me? Leave now. What the? Are you crazy? You're a fake. I told you no pretense. Shit. How can I be so dumb? What are you talking about? Please. Enough natak, huh? I should have seen this man. No Audi, no Rolex and this cheap disgusting deodorant. Fashion corner with a K. You faked your profile, didn't you? What were you thinking? You'll fool a stupid dancer into bed? No, no, no. Please. I didn't mean to trick you. That was not my intention. I'm sorry. Shit. I'm really sorry. So yes, I did fake my wealth on my profile. In fact, it was not me. It was my friend who did that. What? He held a gun at your head and said wear a Rolex watch in the picture? No. He just meant well. Yeah. He knows that I'm crazy about you. But look, it's my picture, my face, right? All me. I didn't fake that. Not all you. Yes, okay. But most of it was me. Just the stuff was in me. You you have to give me that at least, please. I I didn't want to trick you into bed. This is your house. You invited me here. I'm not some kind of a psycho or something. I have nothing. Except for my phone. <laughs> That's the problem. You have nothing. Typical. Huh? What did you say? Tell it to me on my face. I mean, you're typical, isn't it? You want a rich guy, expensive gifts, cars, etc. That's all you want. I thought you were different. You're judging me. Isn't it true? I mean, love, character, those don't matter to you. True? Who are you to talk about truth? You think I am typical? It's you, Manav. If that's even your name. It is. You are a hypocrite. You love being with a self-made girl, but the minute you meet one, you start lecturing her on morality. This from a guy who's faked his profile on a hookup app, <laughs> like that's where you get love and character. I'm not a hookup kind of a guy. I just did this because I'm crazy about you. And that crazy about you? You think that's love? <laughs> You're attracted to me. My looks, my fame, and the glamour of my dance. In fact, you just want what most men want. A doll who you can program her to be what you want her to be. That's unfair. Oh yeah? Then why didn't you go behind someone more like you? Colleague maybe? But no, you're ambitious and you want the glamour. You know you thought you were playing in those big leagues. You like that. But the idea of being with a self-made woman is sexy. But being with one is hard work. What about you? So, you don't have any motives? I have to do some dishes. Huh? We're not going to have sex and I'm... You think I'm in the mood? Look, we can talk if you like. But I would rather be doing something useful while I talk. Because God knows talking to you isn't going to do any good. I have motives. Rather, I had a motive. Sex. But your lies ruined it. What would you like to try today? Congrats again, baby. I'm so proud of you. Hey, sweetie. I missed you since last night. Not now. Can't believe I'm leaving all this and going away. 
Wow. It's next week. Mm-hmm. The date's here already. You've back to Paris? Yeah. Sucks to be away from you. No, no. You should not miss this opportunity. Yeah? Oh. So sweet. Thanks for understanding. Can I have a go? Sure, you can. Welcome. Here are few outfits that you will rock. This is so cool. Just amazing. Option 1. Option 2. Wow. Option 3. Would you like some grooming products to match your outfit? Oh my god. This is a killer. Can I also try? Hey Cha, so nice to see you. Welcome. Look at you. You're a changed man now. Congratulations. Hey Cha. Hi Trisha. Wow, to shaadi kab hai? Shaadi? No way. I mean, haven't even thought about it yet. And Trisha is leaving to France and she's going to be a part of a dance residency there and she's going to tour the world soon. All thanks to him. Oh. He has a business connection in France that made this happen. Nice. Good for you. Yeah. Thanks. Well, I'm not done with the smart mirror yet. You guys catch up. I'm going to try some haute couture. Got lots of shopping to do before I leave. Yeah, I know. Sure, carry on. So, you made it, huh? I guess so. Welcome. A lot of hard work, luck, and inspiration from people like you. The lecture that night changed me. <laughs> is that all this is? What I felt for you was attraction. Nothing more, nothing less. When you say love, it's just attraction. Love is a Rolex watch that you wear to fool yourself. A fake prop people use to hide what they really want. That's cynical. <laughs> Just honest. People lie. You say I love you instead of saying I'm attracted to you or I want you. You begin with a lie and you get stuck. The attraction completely wears off and you can't admit it. So we carry on. <laughs> and you feel virtuous. You think I'm such a good person for doing this. But the fact is you've just added one more lie to cover up the first one. Thank you. Have you never loved? I used to confuse desire with love before. Not anymore. I change partners like I change my body wash. After a while men start feeling the same way too. I stay friends with few but never in a relationship for too long. That just means nagging each other and you know why? Because the attraction is gone and you're frustrated. Exactly. But the guy I sleep with has to be my equal to avoid dependency on either of us. It's called symbiotic in biology. Yeah, I know that. Right. Otherwise if you're unequal it just becomes parasitic inevitably either the guy or me or both of us and that just sucks that's why we can't go down that road <laughs> because i'm not rich because you pretended to be someone you are not that's the needy thing that's the unequal thing you can't deny it it matters to you how rich i am what brands i wear yes i do But remember you lied about them to me. They matter to you more than to me. Since I'm anyway giving you gyan, let me tell you this. Don't look down upon material things. Things are what makes us human. You remove them. We are animals. Animals don't have things, do they? No things, no love. I like my things. So should you. But there is love. Other kinds of love. like man and woman that's just biology but like parents siblings friends sex isn't the only need 
there are other needs this comfort this survival that's what they are and this whole thing of you know mere paas ma hai in diwar is an emotional pissing contest between two siblings and bachan says i have this comfort i have that comfort and then um shashi kapoor yes shashi kapoor thank you he says i have mom it's like saying i have the ultimate comfort so i win ma is an emotional trump card hukum ka ikka in who's got more pissing match wow <laughs> so how did this happen i was getting sleepless stress basically and she approached me for a promotional event i needed someone and it clicked i understand well she made it too then yes she did it was mutual like you always say all of us need something from each other in some or the other way you've got it all wrong i mean things materials exist because of human love and relationships not the other way around not in this world you and i exist because of materialistic things what does your startup do people shop things on your smart mirror wah you want people to buy your things grow your business make profit for yourself and your family no you capitalist love and relationships fir dhanda aur duniya kaise chalegi exactly you should be thankful to me that i'm saving the world's economy by being an ardent consumer of material things that's how government and businesses run in fact religions bhi waise hi chalte hain jo bhagwan jitna zyada mannat puri karega uska utna zyada brand value and popularity the timing was right and our needs were complementary and it fit she's moving on to a better world now and i'm happy for her o m g look who's all grown up tell me one thing does she see that way too well she sure wouldn't show it even if she does that's okay just go easy on her it helped us get where we both wanted to be and not everyone is as comfortable with themselves you are that's what makes you well you bottom line is everything is needs wants and desires love things and use people because the other way around is rarely going to work and who has the time to try so i just keep things simple she knows what we had was convenient transactional you can't change the world and who has the time right busy big shot businessman i hope you have some time to complete the pending transaction between us